two more times. Inhale, right foot forward, left foot back. And then again, inhale, right foot forward, left foot back. And up, exhale down. Inhale, step up. And exhale down. Two from the shoulders. Keep that right knee to your chest. And one, two, really push and extend. Three, point your feet and slowly. What am I doing wrong? I can't do this. Hey boys and girls, it's your girl the BWP here, back with another vlogging video. I haven't done one of these in a while and it's Good Friday today. I'm gonna be hanging out with some friends, going to the gym, making some music later, making some nice food. So I'm gonna take you with me, but I'm gonna start with some breakfast. Got no bananas this morning. Your girl BWP actually does run out of bananas. So I'm gonna be making some porridge. This is what I look like without any makeup on. Here's my breakfast today. I got some oats. They're organic oats. Some sultanas. Got some soy milk in there and it's been sulking for about half an hour. And I'm now gonna add some cacao powder. Three, two, one. Mm-hmm. Well, hello. I have some Canadian maple syrup. I'm just gonna add it to the porridge for a little bit of sweetness. Oh, gonna add a little bit of this milled linseed. I'm hoping that's around about a tablespoon because that's how much I normally have in my smoothies. Well, I'm going to go ahead and add this peanut cocoa brownie bar to the top of the porridge because I'm feeling decadent today. I don't know. Maybe not quite Instagrammable. It's got no fruit on there. That'll do for BWP. That works. That's pretty good. All right, it's time to go out and about. We've got a few things to get hold of today. I need to go and get hold of a bamboo toothbrush because I'm trying to cut down on my plastic. So trying to work towards more of a zero waste kind of lifestyle. Just because I've seen loads of stuff online about all this plastic being dumped into the oceans and it's killing all the sea life. It doesn't make me feel very good about buying plastic anymore. I'm gonna take you to the little shop of vegans. We're gonna go meet Rachel, hopefully she'll be at the shop. Also, maybe get some vegan treats for later. <laughs> Look what's coming today at the Little Shop of Vegans. This book is beautiful, The Vegan Cook and Gardener. Who's done a testimonial in the book? None other than yours truly. I don't know that'll focus. But yeah, this is a book about how to grow your own veg for ultimately all seasons of the year. And then it's got some recipes at the back different seasonal recipes for every season of the year as well. I think you can get on on Amazon now, but come to Little Shop of Vegans, get your copy here. This stuff is incredible. It's basically fudge, but it's cream egg fudge. It tastes just like a cream egg, but in fudge form, really, really good. What's this? Vegan halloumi, made out of cashews. Oh my God, that's got to be insane. This stuff looks insane. Badass bacon. I'm so happy that Rachel's got this in. Thank you, Rachel. the gym now. Gonna meet my friend Georgina for a uh, girl squat day. Gonna be working on our vegan booties because she's been vegan for not even a month yet. She's loving it. Uh, she's big into the gym as well so she's gonna teach me a few moves today. I think it's gonna be a killer workout. Okay. <laughs> 
in space I am. Hello. Oh wow, what well, you got? Good. Are you tried this for the first time? Uh-huh. The wicked. Really good. Yeah, the sweet potato and pakora is amazing. <laughs> Can't see lunges going on in the vegan booty leggings. Killing workouts, not animals. <laughs> Take one. <laughs> We're spiralizing. Spiralization station mm -hmm. for the nation. Here we go. Okay, that's not really working. There we go. Just grab the shaft and twist. I find that's the best. <laughs> the best <way. laughs> it looks tasty. It's, be it's, more, it's healthier than noodles. And, mm -hmm. and it, the trick is not to actually cook it. Just to right. have it raw and then let the, the sauce that you pour the on sauce it. Sauce it up and cooks just it. Just yeah. heats it. And just enough. And it's sort of crunchy and oh, wow. yummy. Yum. Ready? Oh, yeah, it's we're going in. Oh. Oh. We've we got go. the, uh, the zoodle, oh, the zoodles. The Americans call them zoodles. spaghetti. Yeah. Courgette That's what you spaghetti. mean, isn't it? Well, Americans oh, call them zoodles because they have zucchini. They call them zucchini. What? So this is the bank holiday weather that we have at the moment. Oh, I'm not a baker, I you know. I love to cook, but when it comes to baking, are you up for making some like vegan cupcakes and shit? Thank you, Adam. No worries. So Thank you, Adam. Perfect. The Neo Soul for the last few days. Me too. I'm going to start going to the gym more. Mm -hmm. Try and do it before going to work. Hopefully. Yeah. Just try and get up a bit earlier. Go to bed earlier. So as much well. eat, Yeah. I waste so much time in the evenings just faffing around. If I've got to wake up morning and you start cooking a bit and your day, your whole day is just like, mm. boom. <laughs> right, who would like a vegan sausage? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll totally up for this one, thank you. Very, very hot. As we drift in and out of focus. <laughs> jam there we we're just having it at Adam's house and the taxi came went to go and pull the door of the taxi to open it and slid down in the mud because it was raining heavily it was muddy everywhere uh, and I'm now covered in mud anyway I'm home now and I thought I'd give you a bit of a recap of everything I bought today just pulling out my wicked ready meal out the fridge here which I got from Tesco's better get in my stomach baby Moving swiftly on, these are the things I bought today. I hope this is vegan. This is a sponge mop, but it's synthetic. I mean, this thing is crazy useful. I mean, it really cleans the floor really nicely. Trouble is it's wrapped in this plastic, which I feel really guilty about using now. I hate buying things in plastic. The whole thing is made of plastic. Not too proud of myself there. We have the bamboo toothbrush. Vlogging hands! Oh wow. It sounded like a pencil. <laughs> the bristles sound really soft. That's gonna feel really nice on my teeth tonight. The cream egg fudge with the chocolate on top. 
which is divine, it really is. We just got a little cliff bar, I don't know why. Got this thing from the Little Shop of Vegans, which is uh, a white base, which is all natural ingredients. It's just cauliflower, parsnip, fennel, and leeks, and it's like a white sauce that you can add to pasta or to rice. And then I'm really excited to try this uh, hickory liquory smoke. Hickory liquory smoke. <laughs> hickory liquid smoke. I mean, look at that dude. Oh, come on, he looks fantastic. Can you just focus, please? Focus on the cool dude on the front of the bowl. So I got this stuff because I really wanted to make the vegan uh, carrot hot dogs. BWP version, of course. Everything's got to be BWP iced. I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> why am I doing this? A 3 to 2 offer on these vegan and cruelty free beauty products here. So this is the foundation I use which is oil free. It's not going to really focus but it's the Flawless Finish Elf Foundation in Light Ivory. I have a concealer and a highlighter because I've never tried one before and that was the third thing that I got for free because I didn't really know what else to get. Um, I just thought I'd try something new, you know. And then just a little mascara there as well. Length and volume in black. All right, so next day I'm cheating, but I didn't actually try the Wicked Ready Meal last night. So I'm just gonna cook it up now and just show you. What do you do when you don't have a microwave at home? You just do it on the stove, of course. Uh, I hope this is okay. I mean, uh, it's non-stick. Okay. Butternut squash, barbecue flavour, roasted mushrooms and macaroni. It looks like it's got some red cabbage in there as well. Alright! Mastur's liquid smoke. I thought I'd try it on the Mac. Uh, how about we just use this thing to measure it out? Uh, yep. On goes the stalls. But I don't have any black pepper in the cupboard which is a real crying shame, so I'll just have to use these garlic granules, I guess. Just put all the toppings on, the mac and cheese. And I've also got this vegan crack, it's like a vegan parmesan. And I don't know why I'm talking in this Irish accent, but I find it quite amusing. And this has got some nutritional yeast, some garlic powder as well, and some Himalayan salt. It's actually organic activated ornaments. You take one scope, just like so, and you put it on the top, just like your parmesan. Marks out of 10 for this wicked, ready mac cheese. Muck, muck, muck cheese. I would give this butternut vegan mac and cheese a 7 out of 10. Could do a bit more flavour, but it does taste healthy. It's got no grease on it. Drink more